taking you inside the Wolf's Den. Brought to you by Little General Stores. Welcome back to the Neil Brown Show and Inside the Wolf's Den. I'm Wolf Man. Zach Frazier, you are the offensive lineman for the Wolf's Den for this year, 2021. That's right, Zach Frazier, offensive center, man. You've been nailing it down all year long and special honorable mention to James Gamitter. But Zach, get ready, because I'm going to show why you deserve to be an All-American. Roll it. Zach Frazier, the Wolf's Den Offensive Lineman of the Year. 60 pancakes, and I'm going to show you, man, why this dude belongs on an All-American team. Watch Zach Frazier on the screen. He's going to come back, and he's going to cherry pick against the defensive lineman, and he's going to get a twofer. Roll it. Here you go. He comes off the screen, looking back. Oh, that's what I call cherry picking, man. Never sees it coming, and he gets a twofer. Roll it. Oh, nice. Next. Another combo block against the TCU Horn Frogs. Watch as the nose guard angles towards the guard. Frazier does not flinch nor fall on his face because of leaning his weight over his center line. Shoulders are square, goes up to the second level, and uses his technique for a Frazier flapjack. Roll it. Again, look at that technique. He's square, he's on, now he locks in. Flapjack. Watch the defensive lineman for OSU buckle. Roll it. There you go. Oh, you talk about a kid. Oh, look at that. That's just a little extra. And what would I be if I didn't show the Frazier flip against a 300 pounder from Oklahoma State? That's great techniques because the hands are inside. And man, that is really well because this block is a new one. And that's why we call it the Frazier flip. Roll it. Again, look at this. Oh, no. Oh. And then he jumps on top for the body splash. Check this out. This linebacker from Virginia Tech with a blitz twist. Watch how he goes for the high low leverage on the shoulder and back. This is instinctive from his days of wrestling. Roll it. There you go. He goes with the defensive lineman. Now watch. Look at that. Oh, high low. That is amazing. You can't teach that. That's all instinctive, man. Roll it. On his back. I low, baby. <laughs> That's the hokey jokey. And how does Frazier do blocking in space? Watch him here on the screen. Run through this sooner and then come up for number 10 sooner. He doesn't even know what's coming. Roll it. There you go. The block. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Oh, look at the impact and the force. That is amazing. That's called fast twitch, baby. You say you want to see him against the draw? Well, check him out here against the Baylor Bears because he's got a combo here on the draw play and then he's going to do the Frazier Maul. That's right. You heard it. The Frazier Maul. Roll it. Yep. Combo up. Look at this. Oh, he mauls him. Oh, that is good stuff. Give me another pancake. It's absurd, please. And this play sums it up for me about Zach Frazier. He's going to get one guy, two guys, Three and four. He's just plain nasty, just plays to the whistle, just loves the game of football. Roll it. Yep, right there. One, two. Now watch. He was sees his buddy needs help. Oh, look at that. He's gonna give his friends help. That's Zach Frazier. That's WVU and the Wolf's Den Offensive Lineman of the Year. And that's an All-American. And there you have it. That's just a few examples of why I think that Zach Frazier should be some form of All-American this season. At least 60 pancakes this season with I can't tell you how many great blocks. But man, let's go. We got a future with Zach Frazier and the rest of this young offensive line. Boom! When disasters like this happen, you got to call the winning team. Tell your insurance provider you want the restoration company that the Mountaineers call. Panhandle cleaning and restoration. Proud sponsor of the Wolf's Den. Boom!